Welcome to Exercise Timer. This is the first screen you will see when you open the app. Here you will see all of your custom workouts and training plans. Before creating your custom training plans, you might want to try one of our training plans designed by fitness experts. However, in this tutorial, we'll be focusing on creating your custom workout in Exercise Timer. Let's say you have this simple workout which you want to create. To get started, tap the Add button and select New Workout. Here, you can enter your workout name and select a workout icon. You can set a workout description which you can refer to during a workout. OK, so let's add our exercises to this workout. Tap the Add button and select Add Exercise. Let's enter Sit-ups, set the duration to 20 seconds, and Done. The next exercise is a repetitions-based interval. So to add it, just add another exercise, set the name to squats, and enable reps mode. This tells Exercise Timer that you want to tap the screen when you finish your exercise. Notice how I'm still setting the exercise duration to the estimated duration, since it will be used to calculate the total workout time. This time, we're going to set the interval color to blue and done. Go back, set the workout to repeat for 5 laps, and done. You can save your workout and try it out. As set, we have 20 seconds of sit-ups, and if we press next, we have 20 reps of squats. Exercise Timer will automatically time the duration you take to perform the 20 reps. You can see the number of reps from list mode. If you do more, you can tap and edit. This will come in handy if you're logging your reps. OK, let's go back to our workout creator. Let me show you how easy it is to edit your exercises. You can sort your exercises, you can quickly add a rest interval. You can also select multiple exercises and duplicate them. Plus, you can also set the interval duration of multiple exercises at once. Exercise Timer supports complex workouts. Let's say your workout looks like this. No problem. You can use groups to repeat only parts of the workout. This is great for a warm-up or a cool-down. The great thing about group is that you can put it inside another group, like folders on your computer. This makes it possible to create the most complex workouts. If that's not all, Exercise Timer can calculate your calorie burn. This depends on your weight and the specific exercise metabolic equivalent, or MET. An exercise MET depends on the specific exercise. To set it, open your exercise and input the exercise MET. You can learn more about this from this link. Also, if the exercise is a rest interval, make sure to have the rest interval switched on. This will ensure that your exercise is not treated as a normal exercise, but as a rest interval. That's all in this tutorial. In the next tutorial, we'll be going through how to create your custom training plan.